It's impossible to miss these days at any public speaking by the Prime Minister, Minister and Members of Parliament. The slogan, Take Back PNG, used widely like never before. Foremost, I want to thank him for using the catchphrase, the war cry, Take Back PNG. Northern Governor Gary Jufa, who between 2012 and 2018 used the slogan in all his social media posts and parliament debates, says the slogan was not his in the first place. The slogan was actually created by a young man by the name of Jai Smare, and uh, I used it with his permission. My party has promoted it and registered it on behalf of the people of Papua New Guinea. And I believe that the Pangu Party and the Prime Minister are doing exactly what the slogan stands for. But one thing is for sure, Take Back PNG has started a patriotic movement. Governor Jufa pleased with how the Marape government has used the slogan in the past months. At one time when Papua New Guinea had achieved independence, it was tracking on a very positive pathway towards a prosperous, bright future. Somewhere along the way it deviated. It, it fell along the wayside and it got carried away, involved in things that were not productive, that were negative. But once more, it's moving in the right direction under this Prime Minister. I'm very happy that he's using the slogan. But Governor Jufa says that the actual outcome of Take Back PNG will not be seen today, but way into the future. You know, it'll take some time for the slogan to manifest itself throughout the entire length and breadth of the nation. But the point of the matter is, it's about taking true ownership of your country, becoming a truly independent nation, and ensuring that there is a better tomorrow for our children. Following Prime Minister James Marapes' maiden speech, Governor Jufa had called on for the government to look at tax laws. We have to look at our taxes. Our people are overtaxed. We pay the highest tax in the region, 35% on income. It's too much. At the Pangu Gala dinner recently, he admitted that it will take a bit of more than direct change before the government can do any changes on tax. You know, experts and people who are you know, very well aware of the repercussions, ramifications on, on you know, adjusting the tax regime and developing a new tax regime. We feel that there can be adjustments made here and there and uh, I think uh, the tax office under the leadership of the, uh, of the current Commissioner General uh, and the guidance of the current Treasurer will be forging a more positive pathway that will bring some tax relief to taxpayers or companies, etc. This government, I can't speak for what the government's policy is, but from what I do know, the Prime Minister and his government are definitely looking at a tax regime that is PNG friendly as well as investor friendly. But one thing is for sure, the hashtag Take Back PNG has been one of the most popular hashtags since the change of government this year. Adelaide Zirks Kari National. MTV News.